So I wanted to give you a quick look at this, and then after that, I'll I'm gonna prepare a dish, and I'll show you a little bit about it, about how I go about preparing it. But uh, basically, you know, it's pretty simple here. Your controls here, you can set the temperature of the water that you want, and then you've got a timer, and the timer goes up to however long you want it to go for days or more, maybe I don't know. Um, Right now, the temperature of the water is at 129.9, and I set it for 130. And I can change that by hitting that button there, going up or going down. I, in fact, do one of that 130, or well, we can go 131. Okay, and then all you got to do is hit that play button or start button and then you can also hit it to stop it but you can as you can see here it circulates the water and heats it up it's actually already got it up to 131 for the most part this says it's within one degree accurate I'll check it here this is a thermopin these are great actually it says it's 130.3 so it's within a degree um, so that's good and it does heat these up, this water up real quick. You have to have a, a minimum of two and a half inches, and you don't want any more than four to five gallons. This is an 800 watt model. So, you know, you can put a lot in there. So as you can see, it brings it up real quick. And now we'll get started on preparing some food. This is just a regular Ziploc bag. Doesn't have to be anything fancy. You could vacuum seal it if you want, but if you do use Ziploc bags, you want to want to remove all the air out before you put it in the pot. And so this has been in, I don't know, since 12.30 or so, for about four and a half hours. I bumped it up to 135, so we'll take it out of here, and then I'm going to sear it.